Well, good morning, everybody. It's 11 o'clock. It's 73 degrees outside. We've had a little bit of rain last night. I don't know if other people have or not around the area, but we've had a little bit of rain. Um, first of all, I'm going to melt this butter in my microwave. So just a second. Okay. Um, I'm going to make some chocolate uh, walnut bars and nothing you have to bake. Um, everything is done in the one dish, so I'm just waiting for that to, uh, to melt. Meantime, I have this uh, condensed milk. I'm just going to open it. Um, any type of condensed milk would, uh, will work. This is my second batch I've done to this week I did some yesterday to try it to see how it was. So uh, here it is. I show it to you. It's uh, just bars. It has cream crackers. It has walnuts, coconut, and chocolate chips on it. So this is it. So I'm just making another one. Let me get my dish out. Okay, butter's all melted. Just gonna stir it around a little bit. Now basically everything in here except for the butter is one cup. The butter is a half a cup. Just melt it in the pan, a 9 by 9 sheet is all it takes. And did I say you, you do have to bake this? I think I said you don't. Yes, you do. You have to bake this. But uh, first of all, we're going to put one cup of graham crackers in. So... One cup of graham crackers, and I'm not stirring it up. I'm just putting it all over it with my hand here. So we're going to layer everything that we're uh, putting in here. So I'll try to get it quite even. There we go. All I did was layer that. So we're done with this. So the next thing I'm going to layer is um, the coconut. Now, um, I have one cup of coconut. So I'll leave that measure because I used some yesterday. So I have a coconut. I'm just going to put it around. nothing you just layer it okay let me uh, close this up it already closed so um, so I layered the coconut on top of the graham crackers now the next I'm going to layer is the chocolate chips so it's a cup of chocolate chips Go. I'm just going to spread that around evenly, evenly. I don't know if anybody got any rain. We sure need it. I think we got just a very little. A little bit on our blacktop driveway was, uh, was wet. It's all today, but we sure need it. Everybody's grass is just brown. But, so next we're going to do one cup of walnuts. Now the first batch I made, I just chopped the walnuts a little bit. This time I put them through my processor just to make them a little, a little smaller. But each to their own, whatever you would like. And there's a cup of that. And that's going to be layered on top. Just 
layer it here. And there we go, we just layer that. Now the last thing is the condensed milk. And that you're going to spread, try to spread it evenly all over. All over it's going to go. The whole can. It's hard spreading this out of the can, so I'm just going to take this and sort of spread it just a little bit. The edges, just to make it even. And there you go. You can just about see the layers here on the sides. Now I'm going to put that in an oven of 350 for 30 minutes and yesterday I did it for 30 minutes and it came out just right so you watch your times. So I'm going to give you um, the ingredients again. What I did is I took a half a cup of butter or margarine, I used a margarine, and I put it in my 9 by 9 pan and um, I melted it in my microwave. Um, you could melt it and then put it in the pan. It was just easier to do everything in one pan. And then I took one cup of uh, graham cracker crumbs. Um, you can buy your graham cracker crumbs. If you have graham crackers, put them in your processor and just, as long as you have one cup of crumbs. And then it was one cup of sweetened flake coconut. Um, what, one cup of semi-sweet chocolate chips. Um, actually, if you don't want to use chocolate chips, put peanut butter, butterscotch, whatever you would like. Um, one cup of chopped pecans or walnuts. I use pecans because that's what I have. And then one 14-ounce can of condensed milk. Um, you're going to just layer that. You're going to melt the butter. Like I melted the butter, then you're going to sprinkle the breadcrumbs on it, and then you're going to put the coconut on, then the chocolate, um, the nuts, and then last you're going to pour the can of condensed milk over all of it. You're going to bake it in a 350 oven for 30 minutes. Leave, Don't cut it right away, leave it out, it's got to firm up. Just like uh, your chocolate chips and stuff, how they firm up. And um, this is what comes out looking like. I don't know if you can see it right there. You got your graham crackers. Uh, you got your coconut. You can see your chocolate. Your walnuts are on the top. And this is what the top with the Eagle brand milk on, or the condensed milk on it. I don't. Advertise a special because I buy whatever is on sale. And um, I put mine, after it cooled down, I put it in the refrigerator last night. And then um, before I went to bed, I brought it out to make it get cool so I can cut it better. But don't cut it when it's hot because you'll have a mess. Okay? So those are my chocolate wal walnut bars. I hope you enjoyed that. I'm going to put it in my oven now at 350 for 30 minutes. And um, I have a uh, concert to go to tonight over at South Dayton to listen to the music. And that's where I'm making this other batch for to take over to the girls we have supper with over there. Or the girls and the guys that we have supper with. Um, don't forget tomorrow is um, a Thursday, which means the farmer's market is open. Up here in Forestville, if you want a nice ride, just come on down. They have some, a lot of nice stuff. Every year, every seems like every week somebody else has added something onto it. So uh, need your vegetables, your fruits, uh, bird houses. Come on down. There's honey. Um, 
there's soaps, different types of soaps. Uh, there's baked goods. So come on down, enjoy the morning down there. It's from uh, uh, 9 to 1. And it's right in the middle of town. You can't miss it. So in the meantime, I'm going to put my stuff in the oven. Half an hour, I'll get it out and let her cool. So thank you for watching. I hope you all have a nice day. It is 73 out, but there's a nice little breeze and stuff. So it's nice to be outside. So thank you. Take care, and I'll see you later. Oh, in the meantime, I just want to say hi to my friend Steve. And to please stay off the cellar floor. Okay, Steve? All right. Talk to you later, guys. Bye-bye.